Hello everyone. Let's talk about steps for enzyme purification. There are several steps involved in purification of enzyme. These involve selection of suitable source, lysis of cells, removal of cell debris, removal of nucleic acid, precipitation of enzyme and purification by chromatography. The first step of enzyme purification is selection of suitable source of enzyme. The source from which enzyme is to be extracted can be microbial source, plant source or animal source. Most of the microbial enzymes are more stable than analogous enzyme found in plant or animal. Hence, microbes are widely used for purification of industrial enzyme. The other advantage of using microbes is that they grow very fast and they can be cultivated in large amount using bioreactor. The second step for enzyme purification is lysis of cell. The cell lysis is usually required for the purification of intracellular enzyme. The cell lysis can be achieved by various methods. This can be physical method, chemical method or enzymatic method. The physical method involves the use of blender, homogenizer and sonicator which uses ultrasound to lyse the cells. Besides these, freeze-thaw method and grinding the sample in liquid nitrogen is also preferred for cell lysis. The chemical method involves the use of detergent like SDS and Triton X100. These detergent usually removes the cell membrane which ultimately cause cell lysis. Besides physical and chemical method, enzymatic method are also used. For this, enzymes like lysozyme and chitinase are used. Lysozyme is used to break bacterial cell wall, whereas chitinase is used to break fungal cell wall. Once the cells are lysed, the third step is removal of cell debris. For this, the sample is centrifuged at 10,000 rpm. The cell debris gets collected in the pellet, whereas the supernatant has proteins and enzymes that were present in the cytoplasm. Besides protein and enzyme, the supernatant will also have DNA and RNA. The fourth step is removal of nucleic acid. For this, we use the enzymes like DNAs to remove DNA and enzymes like RNAs to remove RNA. The fifth step is precipitation of enzyme. For this purpose, salts like ammonium sulfate and solvents like ethanol and isopropyl alcohol are widely used. The last step is purification of enzyme by chromatography. Different chromatography such as adsorption column chromatography, ion exchange chromatography, gel permeation chromatography and affinity chromatography can be used for final purification of enzyme. 